Well, Mitch, we were so excited just a few months ago to say, Curtain is back up, the McCallum is back, but now really you are in full swing. And how great does it feel to welcome those audience members and know that theater again is once alive in our beautiful valley? Well, after being shut down for 19 months, to be able to reopen the theater has been just a thrill. And now that we're in the height of the season and we're doing shows virtually every night, um, it just feels like the McCallum again. And it's, it really is wonderful to be uh, at a show and know that there's another show tomorrow and that things are continuing. And uh, it, it, it really has been a terrific beginning to the new season and the McCallum reopening. And let's talk about some of the exciting shows you've got planned because I know it's chock full of fabulous and very diverse entertainment. We have uh, something for everyone, really. We have uh, Broadway shows like Fiddler on the Roof, which is coming up, um, Jersey Boys, beautiful, so great Broadway shows. We have some of the artists that have been so popular at the McCallum, the Ten Tenors, uh, coming from Australia. They're going to do a show of their greatest hits, and we have had more uh, uh, participation audiences, you know, at, at Ten Tenors and more sold out shows uh, than any other group in the in the theater's history. And um, we'll have Pink Martini and we have Steve Solomon coming in a couple of weeks with his show. Uh, my mother's Italian, my father's Jewish, and I'm still in therapy. <laughs> I know that's a great show. That's a really popular show. And of course, all CDC protocols are in place. Absolutely. Uh, we're requiring uh, vaccinations. We're requiring masks in the in the auditorium and in the and in the building. So we're trying to keep people as safe as possible. We're following all the protocols backstage. We're testing. We're doing that all. And, uh, and, and that's allowing us to keep the venue open. Right. And I know that uh, people can buy individual tickets. It's not a subscription situation, right? If you want to do one show, if you want to do a couple of shows. So there isn't any limit on uh, getting involved. That's correct. We, we don't do a subscription. Everything is a single ticket. And uh, pick a show. And if you, if you like that, you can call our box office or you can go to McCallumTheater.org and, uh, and those tickets will be ready to be sold. And on a personal note, may we welcome you, Mitch, to not only 2022, but 2023. We are so glad that you will be with us. Again, you have renewed your contract. Well, I, you know, I had retired a couple of times and I came back and I love the theater so much. So I, uh, I'll, I'll retire after next year. <laughs> well, I think you know our Valley very well. I spoke to you a couple of years ago and you talked about how, you know, it's important, I think, for those who are in charge to really know the temperature of the valley and really kind of know what, what our audiences want, what they need, what they want to see again, what they'd like to see fresh. And you really have your finger on the button. Well, I've been here for over 20 years, and I think the valley has changed tremendously. Um, but the McCallum audience, I, I, I think I know that audience and what kinds of programs the audience wants. But I, I do try to reach out. We do a series called Mitch's Picks, where okay. I try to kind of expand on the things that we do and maybe uh, invite people to take a little bit of a chance on, on an artist that they might not know. And we've been, been very successful with that. People are really enjoying some of those artists that we've brought in over the last few years. And personally, because I was a theater major, I love your educational outreach. That's a huge component of the McCallum. Our education program is fantastic. And normally we would, uh, we would communicate and, and, and be involved with 40,000 students and teachers um, because in the last year things have been done virtually we had a virtual education program and our teaching artists were doing this online we were we were interacting with teachers and students and we still even during the pandemic serve 31,000 students Wow that is so so impressive I know there's so much community outreach but there's so much entertainment that you share with our valley we're so grateful we're looking forward to another great season and having you here next year to create another wonderful season well we're looking forward to it we'll be announcing our 2020 2023 season in April. But in the meantime, there's lots and lots of shows this season, and we invite everybody to come on down to the McCallum Theater. Great. Thanks so much, Mitch. Thank you.